My name is Jesse Heilman. I'm a PhD student with the University of California, Riverside, and I'm stationed here at CERN to work on the ME42 NCAP upgrade for the CMS detector. So the ME42s are in the muon NCAP. So if CMS were a sandwich and the NCAPs were the bread, it would be the crust on the outside of the bread. I became involved in this project as part of my service work to be here at CERN. Everybody who is a contributor on the LHC has to help contribute to the operation and maintenance of the uh, machine itself. My name is Elizabeth Kennedy. I'm a third year graduate student at UCR, and I'm here at CERN working uh, on the ME42 Muon NCAP upgrade. Getting to see the actual hardware that gives us the data that we look at every day on our computers is just very exciting. <laughs> Being part of a project like this, I think, is very good at bringing perspective um, of the whole experiment to graduate students who have a very narrow focus as far as analysis goes. One of the most interesting experiences that I had with building these chambers was when the first one that I had worked on was put together and hooked up to voltage and then I watched it detect cosmic ray muons coming from outer space and so something that I had built with my hands allowing me to view invisible particles raining down on me from space really gave me a connection between the manpower that goes into making this kind of project and then the end data that I use to do my PhD research. It's such a unique experience and being down next to CMS is such an awe-inspiring experience as well. It's this giant piece of metal and silicon that will give us information about the most basic level of our universe and we're down there poking at it with screwdrivers in our hands. I guess we always say that CMS is fine precision on a large scale, but just how much how much large scale that really is is mind blowing sometimes.